Good morning, friends. I've been seeking the Lord about confirmation concerning some messages going across uh, YouTube concerning Thanksgiving Day. It seems like uh, something is going to happen on that day, but we have not been sure what. And I asked God to please talk to me about that. So I was praying about it yesterday and last night. Um, I don't know if you can call it a dream or not, but I was thinking about Thanksgiving and heard Isaiah 28. And reading that this morning, it I felt it confirmed in my spirit what is going to happen on Thanksgiving. We know Ison is going to reach perihelion on that day. And I believe that we are waiting on this cosmic disturbance to occur before this three days of darkness. And as I was reading Isaiah 28, uh, God gave me a word. As with all words, brothers and sisters, please prayerfully discern this. Um, Go to the Lord and ask for your own confirmation. He is faithful to speak to you personally. And anyway, here we go. Woe to my people, for they have not given thanks unto me. They look to their idols, to their gods, and give thanks unto the harlots that steal from my children. Woe to you mockers and scoffers, fools that say there is no God. Woe to you, false teachers and preachers that lead my sheep astray. Judgment shall be upon you on your day of thanksgiving that you may know it is I, the great I am, that gives you your corn, your wine, and your oil. Woe to you, unbelievers, for you shall know it is I, the great I am, that creates and makes all things. I am the great I am, the great Jehovah. I am come to repay. Behold, the day of my vengeance draws nigh. It is even here, thus saith the Lord of hosts. Again, please seek the Lord for your own confirmation and prayerfully discern all messages. I urge you to repent of all sins. If you don't know the Lord, you can seek his face. The name of Jesus is the name above all names, and it is the name by which we are saved. If you confess with your mouth, your sins and your belief, and you believe it in your heart, you will be saved. As far as the east is from the west, that's how far God removes our sin from us. So take heart, be encouraged. It is a, it is a strong warning, but if you are in the Lord, he's going to take right good care of us, friends. I love you. I hope you have a blessed day, blessed beyond your hopes and dreams. I hope God puts and in, instills in you a strong faith and a strong hope and strong courage. Do not fear, brothers and sisters. God is going to shelter us and take care of us. I love you in the Lord. Have a good day.